Hi students, welcome back to my channel. Let's now talk about hormones secreted by pancreas. The hormones secreted by pancreas, number one is glucagon. Glucagon is a hormone secreted by alpha cells of pancreas. Alpha cells of pancreas. This alpha cells of pancreas, pancreas, present in the middle of uh, present, in the middle of eyelids of longer hands. Eyelids of longer hands. This glucagon was discovered by Kimball and Merlin. Discovered by Kimball and Merlin. This glucagon is also known as or commonly known as anti-insulin. Anti-insulin hormone. Anti-insulin hormone. This glucagon is uh, mainly concerned with hyperglycemic uh, factor. Hyperglycemic factor. This is secreted, this hormone is secreted, the glucose levels are lower in the blood, lower in the blood. This glucagon is antagonistic. Antagonistic to insulin. The glucagon glucagon uh, stimulates Glucagon stimulates glycosinolysis. Glycosinolysis and lipolysis. Glycosinolysis it means Conversion of glycogen into glucose and lipolysis means conversion of fats into fatty acids and glycerol. Fatty acids and glycerol. means uh, glycosinolysis, glyco means sugar, lysis means breaking down, lipolysis, lipo means fat, lysis means breaking down, 
this is happens when does it happens means when the levels of glucose level when levels of sugar is lower or less in the blood so that is why glycosinolysis energy is demanded so therefore what happens the glycogen is break down and converted into glycogen and now coming to another important to the point of this glucagon is insulin and glucagon insulin and glucagon a control control and at the limit a uh, control feedback mechanism so insulin and glucagon is control and the limit to control the uh, limit control feedback mechanism feedback mechanism that means uh, what do you say this Uh, when the levels of glucose is lower yeah? glucagon is secreted when the levels of glucose is high insulin is secreted that means when glucose levels are increases by the time insulin is secreted by beta cells of pancreas and the levels of glucose is less glucose levels are less in the blood less in the blood it secretes glucagon so therefore these are called antagonistic therefore these are called antagonistic to each other so where did i write this antagonistic to each other antagonistic all right so this is about uh, glucagon so glucagon secreted by alpha cells of pancreas that is hyper uh, glycemic factor it is commonly known as anti insulin it is antagonistic to insulin it stimulates glycosinolysis and lipolysis it stands for like gly conversion of glycogen into glucose and lipolysis means the uh, fats are uh, converted into fatty acids and glycerol This insulin and glucagon is a very important point to control under the uh, limit control feedback mechanism. That means when the levels of glucose is high in the blood, insulin is secreted, so therefore uh, glucose levels are decrease. When the levels of glucose decreases, then uh, glucagon is uh, released from uh, alpha cells of pancreas. I hope you all understand this. Now let us see the next hormone. Next hormone. Uh, if you like this video please share and subscribe my channel thank you thank you for watching